<laughs> All right, everybody, Baron here, and welcome back to Rise of Liberty, aka America. Look at that, we've got Jerry's tent, and what is this? This, my friends, is a new model. We've got some new models for the soldiers, we've got a new map, and I have been told via the intelligence network over in London that we actually have a new weapon. Maybe even the best weapon. Ooh, here it is, the Ferguson rifle, the first breech-loading rifle in history, capable of firing 15 rounds per minute with an accuracy up to 100 meters. So it's not as accurate as this Kentucky long rifle. Oh, I'm loving this, man. You get ranges with these things? Accurate up to 200 meters, so the Kentucky long rifle is incredibly, incredibly good. But this Ferguson rifle, I'm thinking we go for that, and as far as our secondary weapons concerned, I'm really like the axe pistol. A German-made pistol with an axe mounted to the bottom, capable of firing 10 rounds per minute, and is accurate up to 20 meters. So, if they do get in close, we have both melee as well as a ranged weaponry. Let us do this, and we shall deploy! All right, so I've got my Ferguson rifle. Oh, this canyon. I have not played it yet. Oh my gosh, we've got a ton of cavalry. Look at them carrying their lances. And here's the new models. What's up, boys? How you doing? There we go. X is melee. All right, so I've got my Ferguson rifle. Now, this is the first battleman. It looks like here's our first capture flag. I'm seeing some British cavalry. Reload. Oh man, look at this. There's the breach loading. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. I think we're popping them. Now I gotta stay in cover. Oh, I got that guy like right in the arm. Look at this, this guy's charging with a bayonet. Is no one gonna take him out? I'll take him out. Oh, come on boys, I guess they're reloading. Dude, this is going to be an absolutely brutal skirmish here in the middle. You know what we need is we need a better weapon or what I want to try to do is sneak around. Let's see if I can't do that. I'm, I'm not sure about this map, but I'm going to give it the old college try here. Can I climb on these rocks? Oh my god, I can. I am a billy goat. Oh, yes. Now, the enemy are not aware of our my mountaineering skills, but that's fine. They might see me up here, and they might take some pot shots. Oh, look at the cavalry trying to make their way through. So, this is a pretty intense battle. Oh my gosh, it looks like the British are winning here. We have a pretty- uh, is that a, a square formation? I wonder how accurate this is. We, we had to have hit somebody, don't you think? Alright, so this map seems- now wouldn't it be cool if there were boats landing? Or you could take a boat, like little rowboats, and fill them up with like, I don't know, maybe six to eight men or something like that? Hello, sir! What happened to your stomach? Oh my gosh, the British cavalry, they just absolutely blitzed my colonial militia, man. I'm not sure if it was tactics, was it the map? Let's see. So we've only got 12 shots left and we've got to make them count. Dude, it doesn't matter, man. I, I think it'd be really cool to have like a, the last samurai. Oh, look at that. Oh, the colonial cavalry just got wrecked, man. Oh, we've taken- ah! Alright, let's go to weapon select. I'm going to go ahead and take the hand mortar as my secondary, and I'm gonna deploy. And, cause I think- I think this would be pretty good. It just seems like the Brit- THE BRITISH ARE COMING! THE BRITISH ARE COMING! What if I land two by- OH MY GOD, THEY'RE RIGHT THERE! I've got one, two, three- I've got six people to defend against the full battalion here. Oh, we got hit. I'm bleeding out me ears and me nose. I've got my hand cannon, come on. Oh, that cannon did friendly fire. Okay, we hit some of them. This is not the best for accuracy. So I'm actually going to take my talents up to this hill. And there is, I'm wondering, there's a little bit of a frame rate issue. I wonder if that's me or if there's just too many entities or what. It's a trap! Oh, they shot me. We've got to spawn in. We've got to do it again. Woo! Friendly fire cannon. There we go. We got the second wave. Go forth. Iolingas. This isn't Lord of the Rings. This is the Revolutionary War. This is America. Come forth. I mean, it will. I mean, it's going to be the United States of America. What, were they called the United States of America? I should know this. 
Fire the cannon! Oh, that's a little a little short. Come on, boys, you gotta take the cavalry out. How is this not working? Like, they're just they're just chomping through my men, and it's allowing them to build this formation. Alright. Oh, a little behind them again. Alright. So I'm basically artillery. Oh, look at that. I don't like that. British cavalry is mounting and they're trying to take this middle flag. They're ahead by about 25 points. The the fire is getting incredible. There we go. I think that was kind of close, although I need to aim a little bit higher and aim for the middle of this group. Look at them bunching up, dude. Come on, that's got to be a good one. Oh, we just cleared out a bunch of them, dude. I think we got 20 infantry right there. Now the cavalry's charging and just wrecking my men. All right, I'm gonna try... Oh! Now we're out of it. Okay, I think that helped turn the tide. We won the second skirmish, I think. Well, not totally. And their cannons are wrecking us. Now I'm out. Oh! Take them out, boys! Take them out! The cavalry are charging our cannon installations. We will never surrender. Here, let's see. Can I pick this guy off with accuracy? Oh, I think we just hit the dirt in front of him. Alright. So this time, I'm going to enter the field with my men. And I'm going to use my Ferguson Breach Loading Musket. Or would it be a, Bre a Ferguson Rifle, wouldn't it? I think it would be the Ferguson Rifle. Oh, look at this! A flank from behind! The cavalry's here! Look at them trying to... There we go! Go forth, go forth! Oh my gosh! Are, did our cavalry go around the map? Or was it... Did they charge through... Where are these guys come from? What? How did that... It, call it as victory? I did not even know about this other route! Oh! So what happened, I think, was... Is there are two routes to victory. And here we go. Oh my gosh. We're trying to retake this last flag. Come forth, gentlemen! Oh, there's actually a way over here. This canyon is a lot more in-depth than we had originally thought. Come on, men! Oh, we've got no reinforcements this way. And I'm out of cannon shot. Oh, God. Oh my God, look how many British there are. So this one, the AI isn't able to really... Oh, they're looking at me! Get off that horse, you scurvy dog! Oh, okay, they're definitely coming. Now, I, I have no re- oh, okay, I do have reinforcements, I just gotta hold out till they're here. I'm gonna do Swamp Fox, Francis Marion here, man. Basically, Mel Gibson from The Patriot. Aim- oh! oh my god, oh, there's a flag bearer coming with a full squad! Oh, this is bad, they're, they're trying to retake this position. Let's see how fast this reload rate is. Oh, my boys are taking him out! We've got, got a drummer boy down there, too. Look at him. Da, 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 da. Charge! We shall give them the bayonet! I've got you covered, Jerry. Jerry! Do it! Oh, uh, I got... Uh, they got me in the hip, and my hip is... is uh, let's see. Where can I... I'd like to... Do, whoa! What's up, boys? So, from what I... I've talked with the dev. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna go around here. He was saying that he wants to add a campaign. And he wants to add rideable cavalry. I think rideable cavalry would be a lot of fun. I still think boats. Anytime there's amphibious landings in the game, I love it. I don't know what it is about them. I just like how it's kind of a... A take on, like, siege warfare. But a modern take, you know? Like, oh! Instead of having castle walls, I've got... A body of water. And then I've got bunkers. You know the Battle of Bunker Hill? I don't think the British were contested upon their landing. I, I can't confirm that. Bennett! Wait, hold on. I know how to do this. Oh, yeah. That's it right there. All right, you know what? There's some friends in there, but I think we might have to do it. Oh, we, we're taking shots. Hold on. Ha, 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 ha. These guys ain't got nothing on me, mate. Oh, whoa. My guy was rather angry that we got we got a hit. Let's, all right, let's do a different weapon, maybe. As my secondary, do I want... 
I'm gonna take the Kentucky Long Rifle, actually. The cannon's hitting the trees. This is not a very good map to use artillery on because of the close confines. I feel like you're just as likely to, use, uh, to do some friendly fire as you are to hit a decent amount of the enemy infantry. Come forth, gentlemen, come forth! And by come forth, I mean you guys are already there. Yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna try out uh, one of the other battles. I'm, this is a very very interesting look at these guys. Oh man, look at that fire! Oh, they're here. Hold on, I'm gonna use my. <laughs> that guy's a noob. Okay, whoa man. So it's 337 to a thousand. It's been that way since we have one. The cavalry's here, and I have no melee weapon. What you doing, huh? Yeah, get off that horse. Whoa. Whoa! Who did it? Get off that horse. Yeah, so right now it's kinda it's kinda cool to see game development process. Come forth! We need to we need to take this flag. Oh my god, look at that. Now I wish I had my hand cannon. Oh there we go! But yeah, look at this. This is awesome. Look at all the like I love the models, man. I love the reload animations. Oh, and then I got hit. I got hit bad. It's not looking good. All right, it is time to deploy once more. We're gonna go one more time. I'm gonna try to sneak around the right side of the map. I want to explore it. Actually, wait. Spectate. Oh, there we go. Oh my gosh, dude. This is absolutely chaotic. We can shift to fast forward. Wouldn't it be cool if after you took this, there were boats, and then there was like a final fortress? That would be pretty cool. I'm curious how the campaign's gonna be. Cause, I don't know, there's something about archipelagos and islands, which is one of the reasons I've been having so much fun in Sea of Thieves. But I've always thought that the batter of battle, not the batter, it's not like we're making pancakes or anything. Although, I have to say, I would really, really love some chocolate chip, banana, walnut, with syrup and butter. Oh god, alright, I gotta go eat now after this. Go get me some pancakes. Where are these guys going? We're rallying! Oh, now the British are making a move. See, they split up. Man, look at that. Seems most of the action's been happening here. This is what happens when you lose my hand cannon. It evens up a lot more. That is definitely one of- Oh, look at this! How did I miss that? Oh, I thought it was- that's cool. All right, so that's another way around. Okay, the British have taken that flag, and they're forming up, and this guy's just going ham. His name is William. So William with the bayonet! So Billy bayonet! Get him, boys! I want to see them, like, pull out axes and knives. You know? Oh, God, that guy's going to take it right to the ribcage. Now, I think I can choose anybody to spawn in. Let's see, can I look at this guy and spawn in? No, it has to be my team. All right, gentlemen! I need to spawn in, they're right here! So now I get- oh my god, that guy just got taken out. Oh man, this is gonna be bad. We are getting bum-rushed by full squads of infantry. And cavalry. Come forth, reinforcements! We need to pull- we need to push them back! Oh my god, are they- are they coming in over here? It's a pincer movement! Ah, hello there, friends. Get wrecked! Alright, we've pushed them back. I'm gonna go with this squad. I feel like we have a better chance of winning this flank. Look at that. You can see the rallying flag. Oh, there's more British. I'm not sure how accurate I am at what distance. Oh, that tree just got in the way. I think there's... Oh, there's only a handful coming in. So we just gotta take them out. I think we may have even got them in the nuts. In the nuts. Hello, sir. Headshot. Oh, it got stopped by the tree. Okay. Uh-oh. There we go, we knocked one down. Come on, boys! Give it all you she's got! I'm glad that there's friendly fire turned off, or I think in these, like, dense battles right here, there would be- it would be bad, man. Or maybe they're just programmed not to hurt each other. Alright, we've gotta take this flag, we've gotta retake it before the British reinforcements come, which you know is going to be soon. Hello, sir, how was your day? Pretty bad, I guess, as you've taken one to the shoulder blade. And there we go. That's one for the good guys. Now I'm gonna try to peek over here. There's probably another way over. Oh, wait a minute. Did we find a secret cavern? Ah, look at us. Come on, Billy Goat's Gruff. Okay, not necessarily a secret. It was kind of 
Oh, God. Oh, my. Hello, boys. There we go. We're dropping them from behind. They're definitely... Oh, they're definitely outnumbering. Okay. All right, we're back to Bunker Hill. Ah, the frames are much better here. I think the issue is the map, interestingly enough. I'm, I'm curious as to why. We've got some flutists, and we've got the new models. See, this is what I want to see on a nice, bright day. Out here in jolly old, I don't know, where's Bunker Hill? Oh, Bunker Hill was outside of Boston. By the way, speaking of Boston, who's going to PAX uh, East? PAX East Boston, jeez. The sound effects from the artillery. Who, where are you shooting, buddy? There's boats out there, Baron, and we shooting at them. Gentlemen, the British are coming. You're looking the wrong way. They're over there. Oh, we actually got one, I think. Oh my gosh. Cannons coming in, boys. You better turn around. Oh yeah, I've got my Ferguson, or not my Ferguson rifle, my Kentucky rifle. Oh, they ran me with a ja with a lance. It's called a lance. Hello. Oh! They've overrun our position. They're causing chaos in the ranks. We got a 360 no scope, these guys. Oh no, we took it. We took a musket ball. Where are the French reinforcements? Now that would be cool. Imagine for a moment. Actually, here we go. Imagine while this battle's going on on Bunker Hill, even though it's not historical, you know, maybe a different scenario where all of a sudden some ships come in off the coast and they've got cannons and they're firing from distance and then all of a sudden a bunch of rowboats come in and it's like revolutionary war d-day all right where do i want to spawn in it looks like are we holding this side here we go yusa yusa i would like to be yusa get off my land what's my secondary do we all oh oh no it's it's just my guns that i get as secondaries Charge! Let's see who reloads faster. Me with my Ferguson rifle or you? Oh, cavalry's here. I'm I'm just I'm just YOLOing on the battlefield. As my buddy Stone would do. We're running amok, man. We got we got another Rambo. Whoa! That cannon was at me. Oh, hit the wrong guy. Oh man, son of a biscuit! Yeah, dude, that's what's up. And see, this would never have happened in Bunker Hill unless I was there. It's basically Mel Gibson Rambo. Dun, 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 dun. Hello, boys. Jolly day. Jolly good day. Oh, yeah? Who's who's faster? Me reloading. <gasps> he shot me. All right, so the British have broken through. Oh, my God, they're everywhere. They're bayoneting that poor guy. Come on, Samson. Hold the line. We're, we're not, our reinforcements, I don't think, are going to be able to get to the battlements before, if, the, if that cavalry wants to hit us, they could. We've held the left flank, and we're reinforcing the center. Okay, actually, we're counterattacking now. We're counterattacking to retake the command hill here. Oh, yeah, there we go. We should be able to hold it if the cavalry supports. Oh, did you see that? That was a decent animation. So, I think if the animations, the character animations, could be a little more dynamic, like Ravenfield, That'd be really cool. I wonder if you could implement physics to the point where guys could get... When a cannon would land near you, they would go flying. But maybe that's a lot to ask for, you know, because like if you look at a game like Tabs, that game is completely about physics, and I know that's pretty demanding. So with this many entities, I think physics might, you know, cause lag. I'm not really sure. I'm not a game developer, but it, it, does, it does get you curious. Oh, that cannon... Look at this cavalry, man. The British Dragoons here are just absolutely destroying everything. Look at this poor guy. You better hold this. Look there. Look at this man, that charge. Oh my gosh. Gah! And he's gone, man. Just like that. Cologne in the... Oh my gosh. There's just no way, man. There's no way. This is not good. The British have overrun the beginning of Bunker Hill. This is kind of like the battle simulator part where I just get to watch. I don't get to put their, I don't get to decide where the starting positions are, what units have what, but that would be pretty cool. One can only dream, right? Oh, there we go. A colonial dragoon or a colonial, what was the, the, the cav, the different kinds of cavalry in this area, the Napoleonic and Revolutionary era. 
the American Revolution. I know a lot of different countries had a revolution, but you know what? I'm American, so when I think of the Revolutionary War, the Revolutionary War is for my country, as is my bias, right? So look at this. Come on, boys. We, we've got a nice firing line. I'm surprised those guys are still on their horses. I guess the reload rate, and these guys are triggered to, to bayonet charge. Hold the line, boys. Reman that cannon. Oh, the British are here. Oh man, that's a lot of British. And are they turning this cannon against them? Look at this guy. Man, I tell you what, if you're the British, you love to see this. Oh my gosh. All right. Look at that, man. Is there like any way to stop this? Hmm, actually, the Americans have an incredible amount of score. 504, the British only have eight, and I think it's because the score points are determined via holding of the flags, and the British don't have any flags. But this is kind of like a wave attack, you know? Ooh, here we go. If there was a campaign, what battles of the Revolutionary War, the American Revolutionary War, would you like to see in the campaign? I know that a lot of mine, like, comes from the movie Patriot. There were a lot of really cool battles. I know the Battle of Cowpens is one. The bat well, Battle of Bunker Hill is probably number one for me because it's all about defending a fort against tons and tons of, like, British attack. You know, just waves and waves. And I love wave defense games. Incoming cannonballs! That would be pretty sweet. This is my stats overall, so they've added that as well. And by they, I mean, this is a single dev that's made this game. A young kid, man. It's pretty impressive. I'm very, like, I'm, I'm pretty impressed, you know? Like, I want to develop games. This guy just went out and did it, man. You gotta give, that's a lot of respect. Or, you know, in my book. Now, is anything happening? Are there any flanks over here? It does not seem like it, even though it is a viable opportunity, although you'd have to go around the water. Now, actually, what happens if we go in the water? I want to see. What are you doing back here, soldier? I'm just uh, guarding the uh, rum barrels here. Let's go in the water and see what happens. Ah, it's endless flats. Okay, so we're walking in a nice flat area. And I could go out further, but I, I do not wish to do that. I wish to help my colonialists. My revolutionaries. Operate this cannon and bring forth revenge, gentlemen. Bring forth revenge. Isn't, isn't our ship the Queen Anne's Revenge? Was that a pirate ship? Or was that a ship of the line? Oh my gosh. You idiots. Charge! Alright guys, well that does it for Rise of Liberty. We've got the new Ferguson rifle. What you doing, man? I'm swimming in the rum barrels, Baron. They're tasty. I don't want to rush these British men. This are scary. Dude, You have if you use the hand cannon here, it is a game changer. So we have the new map. Ooh, this is cool. I like this. Oh, man. I, I just love the forts. I feel like I love the de defending forts. I don't know what it is. But anyway, Ferguson Rifle and the new map, the canyon. What would you add to Rise of Liberty? Let me know, and I'll see you guys in the next video.